Hello guys, this is part three on how to make my suburban house now. I'm sorry I didn't get a chance to say goodbye in the last part. I just I I just realized that my time limit and it cut me off. So I'm sorry about that, but anyway, let's get started in the next part. So we've got enough lighting in the gaps that aren't gonna be viewed. So that's good. So let's build another row of gray concrete, and that's where the roof is going to be introduced. Now we also need to get some more gray concrete in places because that's basically where you're going to be seeing more parts of the roof. So Let's also build this shape here, and also this shape. Next, let's build some quartz stairs right here. Overhanging one. Come into this side. Then keep going. Then turn again. And then you'll finally have an end to stick out to as well. It's basically the sides where I built these pillars of concrete. And now you're going to build an upside down, a regular facing, upside down, regular facing. Now reverse this, it's a little hard to reverse, but got to do it right now because we'll, it kind of makes placing the regular facing stairs a tad easier. And that's what's going to stick out. And we're also going to build the upside down stair thing again because that's what we want. And now we want to have this. Now all we have to do with the roof is basically build stone brick stairs in the little fleshy part, like the little area where there's going to be stone brick. And there's actually a little change on the roof, which I'll mention in a minute, once we actually get into building the inner part of the roof. So... We're going to be in a little bit of a disaster for me because it's going to be a little hard to figure out and explain what I have to do at this moment. Well, I'm going to try this. Okay, I just realized it won't be too hard. So let's just build the outline of this area and then this is what our roof should really look like. We also have stone brick stairs to cover up here, which I'll show you right now. So we're going to build around here, and then let's turn it this way, then this way again, and this way, and this way. That's actually it for the suburban house. So now we have the exterior and all this stuff. We have a working doorbell and we actually have the little interior with working lights like that and we also have one right here it's really cool I really like it now we're gonna keep them on so bats don't spawn because they're one of the evilest mobs in the game I can tell you why it's because well, they make annoying noises, they always spawn big gaps, and they're just annoying in general. I don't know why, but it's also because they're hard to kill when, you're, when you don't want them in your world. Anyway, that's basically it. It's so cool. I'll see you in, in the next parts. Goodbye. I mean, not in the next parts. Sorry, in the next builds.